Hey guys, how's it going? I like to mow here. And just a little update for the weekend. We did seven lawns today. Or six lawns today and one yesterday, actually. Um, notice the turf tracer is not here. That would be because I uh, royally screwed up when I was working on it. Yeah, the uh, camera's dirty. There we go. Um, yeah, so when I royally screwed up on it, uh, I was putting a new deck belt on it. Well, I put the belt keeper in the wrong holes, so it got stuck under all the clutch pulleys, which was too much for me to take apart because I didn't want to get more into it and not have, not be able to put it back together. So I just said, screw it, I'm just going to take it to the dealer and let them deal with it. <laughs> So, that's what I did, and that's why there's just a sulky laying under the trailer. But if you're on my Snapchat and Instagram, you saw that I had a zero turn today. Well, that's because I rented a 60-inch Gravely Pro Turn 160, and boy, am I glad I did, because... I would not have been able to push mow with my helper six lawns today. That would just not be possible. Um, yeah, it was nice. I rented it from a guy on Craigslist. Uh, and basically, I originally was going to ask rent the 52, but he didn't have any. 50, or he had just sold his 52, so he just had two 60s. So I took the 60 and he said he'll throw in the trailer for free. So I was like, okay. So it was $75 for a day rental. I got it at 7.30 this morning and then returned it at about 6 and six o'clock in the evening. So that wasn't too bad. We did finish all our lawns in the neighborhood before noontime, though, which was pretty cool. We were doing, we were making good time mowing some of these yards with this big mower. There's only one that I could not fit in, which was one of my uh, long time yards that I've had. So we just pushed mowed the back, but that was no big deal. Everything else we can mow with the big mower though, which is nice. So on top of, so on top of the turf tracer being down, my trailer lights are having issues again, which. Is, just being annoying. I don't know what the deal is now. In this time, it's both tail lights or the brake lights are not working. So I have running lights. So I don't know what the deal is with it. I'm gonna probably just switch it to LEDs and be done with it because this is just getting on my nerves. But that's basically the extent of my weekend at first I was pretty stressed out because I didn't know if I'd be able to finish all my lawns but uh turns out I was just able to rent a zero turn and get it all done so that was nice and the dealer is pretty backed up right now so it's looking like I might have to rent it again next weekend because they are so busy with mowers so the trailer that the guy included with the mower was a uh, 16, 6x16 tandem axle utility trailer and uh, didn't have brakes on it or anything. And that's about the extent of the, or the largest trailer I'd tow uh, with our truck because it, like, our, we, have to, we just have a half ton Honda Ridgeline and it was. I mean, it could maintain 55 with a 16-foot trailer, but that was pretty pretty uh, hard to maintain. So, yeah, that's about it. Just got everything done today, so that was nice. But uh, now we're just going to wait and see how long it'll take to get the turf tracer fixed. Um... Hopefully not too long, but I kind of want to have to rent the zero turn again next weekend just because it's so much nicer to mow these lawns with a zero turn because you aren't sore at the end of the day as much. But, 
yeah guys that's about it for now don't really have much going on otherwise and quite frankly I'm now that I've used a zero turn for all my lawns that's what I want to get <laughs> but I know I won't be able to get that because just because I have uh, don't have any space nor will my parents let me get the mower so that's about it for now guys thanks for watching and I will see you maybe this week with some tractor videos otherwise next weekend anyways see you later